Thank you, Madam Speaker. And uh, I'd like to speak to the motion to substitute the minority report for House Bill 2787A. To the motion. Colleagues, I'm in favor of this minority report. And I'm speaking on behalf of the employers and the employees, employers, not AOI, but the employers who actually hire employees in the state. They're constituents of us all. Federal law requires employers to follow certain processes. One is non-discrimination in the hiring process. The Minority Report points this out. You interview a person, you pick the most qualified person based on the interviewing process, and then, only then when you made a decision to hire that person, do you f ask and complete a 99 form. Madam Speaker, permission to use a visual aid. Representative Cameron is requesting uh, to use a visual aid uh, without objection, so ordered. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Colleagues, I'm holding up an I-9 form. This form is attached to the minority report. If at some point in time our employer, employers in this state have interviewed and made a decision to hire somebody, they now have to complete this I-9 form. They've been doing this since the 1980s. Column A, one document from column A, two documents from columns B and C. The person supplies those documents, they are now qualified to work in the state of Oregon or anywhere in the United States. Remember, the best person for the job, regardless of their legal presence, now they have to prove that they have a legal right to work here. Failure to do that, guess what happens? I, as an employer, or any other employer in the state of Oregon, has to turn away the best qualified person to hire. Do I like to do that? Does anybody like to do that? Absolutely not. But that is the rules, the federal rules. Colleagues, the Minority Report respects the current federal immigration process. We may agree or disagree with the current process, but that's what the Minority Report does, and it shows respect for the people that are following that process, both on the individual side and both on our great employers in the state of Oregon who are hiring these people. The Minority Report, colleagues, places value on the following on that particular process. It sends a signal to the employees that are following that process and to the employers that we appreciate them following the legal federal process. And finally, colleagues, I've had to deny employment to people that I wanted to hire. I don't want to do that. But I want to follow the law. Please adopt something that will give the students the chance that qualify through this program when they go to college to get a job legally to allow our employers to hire them so that they can earn the money so they don't come out of college with a high amount of debt as we've heard they're going to have to pay cash. Don't set them up for failure. Don't allow them to go to college and say, now you've got this huge amount of debt, but you have no legal right to work and pay for it. Colleagues, I urge your support of the Minority Report. Thank you.